Hello everybody, we are back, and a forgotten beast has come. He has come, he has. So, let's actually take care of this one with our little military. Game is paused, military alerts, danger. You restrict all the civilians to the burrow. And mobilize the army. You go there. You guys go there. <sighs> yep. Who is doing what? Cancel store item and stockpile. Really? I have the sneaking suspicion it's this space here they're complaining about. I was right. Huzzah. So, where is this forgotten beast? Oh, there's a giant cave toad down there as well. I'll kill you later. So where are you? Oh god, you fly. So that's a problem. He flies. And he's also just disappeared. The stairs are over here, so I don't know what he's going for. I do not know at all what that guy's going for. Oh, it looks like he's following a raven of some sort. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know what he's doing. Did he attack anything? Nope. Uh, the Marks Dwarfs are going to be collecting equipment, mostly. The scholars are doing scholarly things. Uh, two of them are actually in the military, so... Many of the other Forgotten Beasts kind of tend to make a beeline straight for the fort. This one's not. I don't know why. <sighs> it is a little bit annoying. Oh my god, you're still linking shit up to triggers. Oh, we've got that many... Huh. So, two elite Marks Dwarves, one Sword Master, and four spear masters. We basically now have an invincible military. We don't actually have any way to path to this guy where he is. So we just have to watch what he does. I do think I can do this. <sighs> Yeah, I'll have to pick that stuff back up later. I don't want to fight him down in the cave. On the bright side, he has to move in to engage anything. The trees are so thick now that it's entirely possible he can't get to us either. I question how much of an issue that actually is, but it could be one. Yeah, because there's a tree there, so he can't move through that. He could go this way. To get to here. Which would give him access to the stairs over here. 
but he doesn't seem to be particularly eager to go anywhere. He's moseying around in the water. I'm halfway tempted to send my military after him. By the same token, probably not particularly safe. Ooh. General familiarity with Jaguar trading methods. Woot, we've made a breakthrough. The first breakthrough in the fortress. Well, if he can't come to us, can we go to him? Unreachable location, so no, we can't. Um, he can't reach us. Nope, we gotta fix this. That's not really a brilliant situation. Look at all those cobwebs. more um, wider paths to these places. So that we can actually get around. Because we're running into a problem where um, we can't get around down there. Well, military alerts. We're safe for now and I need these people to go down there and start cutting the trees away so that we can actually get to the forgotten beast as this is a problem you guys get down here hmm. and this could take a little while to fix Takes some time as everyone's pretty busy. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep an eye on this thing and we'll have a jump cut when we finally are able to reach it. So, we'll be back and pause and recording. Alrighty, here we are. The Forgotten Beast has moved somewhere my guys can get to, and leading the charge is Lore. I'm just going to call him Lore. I don't know how to pronounce the rest of that name. And then the recruit following him. I don't like the fact that the recruit... Okay, there we go. Oh, the recruit fires! And he hits immediately! And he has improved his art archery. It wasn't that big of a... wasn't that wounding a shot, but he hit first shot, so that's good for him. Okay. <clears throat> hmm. Right front leg, he was stabbed, it enrages him, and he falls over. He gets stabbed again in the right foot, in the front foot, and uh, no real damage. I have the sneaking suspicion because he's already been missing. This will be relatively one-sided, as long as he doesn't go for the recruit. <clears throat> Why are you biting it? Don't bite it! That's a bad idea. In fact, getting... Oh. That was quick. <clears throat> Well, who's got blood on him? Do 
Dwarf Tears. Dwarf Tears. No blood. Nobody has blood on them. So that wasn't so bad. And while you're down here, there's a cave toad that needs to die. Kill it, please. Unreachable target? Nope, it's very much a reachable target. <clears throat> Where the hell are you going? I don't actually know where these people are going again. Oh well. No books. No books, no books, no books. Hmm. I thought the cave toad was over here. And apparently it is. I'm going to name this something bizarre something that no one else would name it. Uh, Rith looted is bizarre and unworldly? Okay. So now we have an artifact, well, Masterwork Artifact Steel Spear. Because of all the kills it's got. And he just killed a forgotten beast with it. Huzzah. Freaking... 11 kills with this, which isn't too bad. Getting named weapons, they're not artifacts though, which makes me sad. It'd be nice to get an actual artifact weapon, but no, we haven't haven't quite had that luck yet. <coughs> the toad's gonna die. The toad's gonna die. Probably really quick. <coughs> Because I just don't want violent critters down here. I don't. I don't mind violent critters so much as I mind critters that can kill my dwarves. Boom. Doesn't take very long for him to get there and then do two attacks. That toad will not last long, and he's dead. It's a fury of blows right there. A true fury of blows. Okay, so that threat's gone. Reorganizing the refuse pile. Moving stuff around. <sighs> Sorting it back out again. Oh no, there's a man. Never mind. Okay. Not suspended anymore. Still have to hook up most of those to that lever. As those guys are still there. <sighs> it's, uh, that's kind of annoying, isn't it? But yeah. So. That Forgotten Beast wasn't all that much of a problem, was it? And now, uh, I guess I'll bring this episode to an end, as there's not a hell of a lot going on. Scholars are finally doing scholarly things. People are storing items, drinking, and so forth. It's kind of annoying. Hopefully someone will finally go down there and actually clean up some of the stuff. But that is no guarantee. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you later. Thank you all for watching my video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed it. Also, don't forget to hit that stupid little bell thing that YouTube has added, because otherwise you won't get notifications of any new videos if you su subscribe. Also, follow me on Twitter, at GenGeft. 
as I always have my video updates on there, so you will never miss a video if you're on my Twitter feed, because it'll all be posted, and any other dumbass comment I make as well. So, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.